Hello guys, welcome back to the Brutal Masters channel. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day today. In this episode, we're going to talk about yet another project that recently got listed on Coinbase. And this project is called the SHPING token or the shipping token, right? Again, as always guys, I highly recommend you guys to do your research on any of the projects we cover on our channel. And for this project, I recommend you guys to go to their website shipping or shping.com in order to learn more about this project right so since there is no real information presented on coin market caps page for this token i'm going to rely on the information presented on their website but this is only going to be a peripheral analysis which means you need to do your own in-depth research before you put your hard and money on this token right so what is shipping so right off the bat when we go to the website they are stating that this project is for token holders and they are like what to know about shipping coin right so this is a an ethereum based project that is uh, an erc20 token and how shipping works is the shipping app uses um, you know our own cryptocurrency shipping coin to help brands reward customers for their engagement and loyalty so when it comes to uh, you know brands uh, and products, there is no real current way in order for brands to directly access their customers and to engage with them in order to understand how loyal they are, right? Uh, shipping is an app that basically uses their own cryptocurrency called the shipping coin that basically enables brands to reward their customers in order for engagement with their platform and for being loyal to their platform, right? It all starts by scanning a barcode and then the user can get rewarded for watching videos, writing product reviews, connecting with brands and scanning purchase receipts. So you can basically do this by scanning a barcode and then as a user you get rewarded for watching videos, writing product reviews, connecting with brands and for scanning purchase receipts. So it's basically a very uh, you know, uh, a very simple to do activity kind of like project where you can do these things to get, uh, to get, get connection with your brand and to help the brand understand what you are expecting from their product, right? So the coin can also be bought and sold via exchanges and you can cash out your shipping coin earnings via the mobile app. So you can basically use the exchanges, uh, some of the exchanges that are listing this token, including Coinbase, in order to buy and sell the tokens, right? Uh, you don't necessarily have to use the app, but you can directly buy and sell the tokens from the exchanges themselves. And you can cash out your shipping coins. So if you do have some shipping coins after performing some of these activities, you can cash it out using your mobile app itself, right? So uh, here they have a video of how this project works and I highly recommend you guys to check out this video and to learn more about this project. This will provide you a good information about what this project is and how you can use it, right? So if you see here, as I mentioned, it is an Ethereum based project. So they have provided their ERC20 contract address for the token. Um, it is 18 decimals just like uh, any other ERC20 token. Um, you can basically um, search for this project on Prime Market Cap, even though you won't necessarily find any necessary uh, you know, description about this project itself. You can find a lot of numbers which includes market cap, the price of the token, the tokenomics and everything right from Prime Market Cap. You can also find relevant information from Etherscan, right? So, uh, would you like to know more? So if you want to see their white paper, which I highly recommend you guys to do and see their one pager as well. If you are trying to uh, skim through this project for a quick research, you can do that by clicking on these links, right? So uh, shipping coin, the shipping coin economy. So it does have its own economy. Shipping coins is used by brands to, to incentivize shipping app users to engage with product information and participate in other pre and post purchase activities through the app. So again, as I mentioned, um, this is an opportunity for brands. So if you have a brand and if you want to understand your customers' feedback and to see what kind of experiences they are having and when they're using your product, you can use the shipping coin in order to gain some valuable insights in order to improve your brand or product, right? So 
uh, you can reward them with their shipping token and you can uh, do this either by a pre or a post purchase activity through the shipping app right and if you scroll below you can clearly see that where can you buy shipping coin so shipping coin itself is a purchasable uh, token uh, which you can buy and sell apart from earning it from the app itself so you can use coinbase which is uh, the exchange that listed this token uh, you can buy it from liquid uh, timex exchange sushi swap and uniswap right so we'll cover a list of these exchanges uh, in a few seconds now and when it comes to roadmap itself which it is it is important to understand the roadmap because the project definitely may have a uh, long term as well as a short term goal so any project that you are trying to invest in ensure make sure that you review through the roadmap as well right which is given here so token holders you can basically keep in touch or uh, get newsletters from their project by subscribing to their newsletter here uh, and you can also follow them on their uh, social media sites which is at the bottom of this page and also get other information from this project itself right it is definitely uh, it, it, it is good to note that this is a australia based australian project so you definitely need to ensure that uh, you know you do some research and understand uh, about the project and what uh, you know it, it entails to participate in their uh, you know app as well as their surveys and you know uh, their other events that they have in order to make sure that you are uh, you know comfortable with using this uh, project as well as the app right so that's all that is information to from, from this project uh, from the website so let's go to the coin market cap page right so in terms to coin market cap uh, this project is currently ranked 470th by market cap on coin market cap and it's currently trading at 4.6 cents per token at the time i'm making this video with about 1.26 percent decrease the past 24 hours right so it seems like the market cap is slightly shrinking immediately after the coin is listing uh, and the market cap is about 81 million dollars in market cap so less than 100 million dollars which is quite uh, remarkable if you see a lot of uh, people don't necessarily know about this project so it is still in the very early stages of its uh, you know um, of its growth right so a project that's worth 81 million dollars in market cap is still a good opportunity to get into if you do like this product right when it comes to the max supply they don't necessarily have a max supply which is a kind of like a bad thing because a project like this that mainly depends on uh, you know uh, incentivizing uh, user experience uh, you know um, in order to provide in order to get the information uh, to the uh, you know brands or uh, you know um, owners of shops uh, or product owners uh, is going to be a little hard because uh, usually there are uh, apps that pay like in dollar terms uh, like a 25 cent uh, you know uh, per survey kind of thing which directly gives dollars but this uh, token may be uh, very volatile and at the same time since the token doesn't necessarily have a max supply uh, in theory it is going to be going down in value uh, over a considerable period of time so that's something to note if in case you are planning to buy this token right and the total supply is uh, 10 billion tokens which is a huge supply so again there's a lot of chances that this token would be dumped and there's no real incentive for people to hold this token which is kind of like a bad thing because if you are trying to invest in a project you need to make sure that there's a lot of incentives for you to either hold on to it or stake it or provide liquidity or in some way burn it as well in order to make sure that uh, tokens value is appreciate, uh, appreciating but it seems like for the shipping token there is really no incentive for people to hold on to this token because you uh, spend some time to do some surveys or participate in an event uh, for the company to know what uh, your experience is with their product and then you get rewarded with this token and you just dump this token and get your money right so that's basically how most people will be using this token for and some people may potentially provide liquidity in uh, you know uh, sushi swap or uni swap but uh, considering the fact that not a lot of people will be willing to trade this token especially in ethereum with the high gas fees i think you are not going to get any more uh, you know any uh, significant liquidity fees by using this token as liquidity right so it seems like the tokenomics is a, a definitely a big letdown for the product right when it comes to the chart itself you can clearly see that this token uh, despite the you know the literally uh, the, the, the little uh, lack of activity of this token for a very long time in fact since 2018 uh, when this token price was worth 0 0.0005 dollars per token which is significantly lower than the token price right now 
uh, this token has pretty much do, done absolutely nothing for quite some time in fact it even reached uh, 0 0.00002 or even 0 0001 uh, dollars per token throughout 2019 and 2020 and again it was pretty flat as you can see until you know sometime uh, you know after the q1 of 2021 it was when this token went from 0 0.0001 dollars to a new all-time high of 0 0.004 us dollars per token and then it crashed down moved sideways was quite volatile throughout the later part of 2021 until the end of 2021 when the token went from 0 0.001 us dollars per token and it literally skyrocketed to the moon literally reaching six cents per token which is a huge you know um, you know peak uh, and now it is declining so this token is a very very high risk token as you can see a lot of people who bought this token at the top which is six cents are going to be losing a lot of money really soon because this token is already reversing and this token is still literally close to its all time high right now by being uh, at the four cent mark but it will definitely dump really really hard i think the floor price for this token will probably be somewhere between 0 0.01 dollars which is one cent per token or 0 0.001 dollars per token which is again less than one cent one cent uh, but this is going to be definitely not going to come up to any time soon to a price about two to three cents per token because i feel like this token is going to dump and if you see the history of the token it's been around since 2018 and it's done absolutely nothing until quite recently so it is definitely a very high risk project which we need to be extremely careful about i'm not really sure why coinbase is listing this high risk project because there is a lot of people who are going to look at the sticker price of this token and think that this is going to be a project that will do 100x but it's already done 100x the, the, the fact of the matter is the fact is since it's one two or three cents per token that already indicates that this token is done multiple excess because it was initially worth less than one cent per token and was significantly less than one cent per token uh, throughout 2019 uh, 2020 right so coinbase is definitely trying to screw a lot of people by listing this token and giving them false hope that this token is going to do 100x when this is only going to dump significantly right and if you see the tokenomics the tokenomics is also uh, you know pretty bad uh, there is no real max supply and the total supply is 10 billion tokens so there's definitely no incentive for people to hold on to this token or even like you know farm this token or stake it and therefore they are going to dump this token which is going to be a sad thing to see but i'm definitely going to you know avoid this token and i suggest you guys to do the same as well right so in the dollar comparative you are definitely going to see this token dump even harder in the bitcoin comparative you can clearly see that this token has a similar price pattern as dollar comparative where the initial price was significantly less than you know one satoshi per token and it is again uh, it has been like that since 2019 and 2020 uh, with occasional peaks early 2021 but pretty much nothing but in 2020 end of 2021 early 2022 this token started pumping from nowhere reaching a new all-time high in the bitcoin comparative of about uh, 10 satoshis per token so it went from literally less than one satoshi per token to 10 satoshis per token which is quite a remarkable pump for people who made money or made uh, you know a lot of money during the pump uh, you know congratulations to you guys but for people who bought this token at the peak uh, you know it, it sucks to be you because you are definitely losing a lot of money and you will continue to lose a lot of money because this token is literally taking a huge reversal right now right so i would definitely not recommend buying this token if you do for some reason want to buy this token i would never suggest you to buy this token you know above the one cent mark because the one cent mark is definitely going to uh, you know be a really hard achieve for this token once it's dumb right now right and it seems like it is dumping pretty rapidly so when it comes to the market itself as we saw you can buy this from coinbase using usd usdt and euros you can also buy this token from uniswap cc swap and there's also an exchange called timex which i wouldn't really recommend because it seems like it's a brand new exchange but you can get this from dodo if you want to buy this from ethereum or you can get this from the liquid exchange itself right but again my final verdict for this token guys i would never recommend this token to you it seems like this token has literally no unique use case it is definitely a token that is going to be dumped a lot because of its horrendous tokenomics and it literally is a token that's provided by 
brands to get your opinion and therefore you are more likely to dump this token rather than hardling this for long term right i can see this token making some really good gains providing it goes to an all time low or a really really uh, uh, bottom price point which is when if you want to buy this token you can probably buy a little bit of this token and hardle this uh, till it starts pumping when, and when it pumps make sure you to dump it as soon as possible because it's going to reverse as uh, as soon as it uh, you know pumps right so you need to be very careful with this token because it's a very high risk token right so yeah remember guys you guys are not regular investors you guys are brutal investors so stay brutal thank you very much for watching my video guys if you like my video please hit the like button and subscribe for more videos see you in my next video bye